Hello everyone, and Merry Christmas. Alright, I'm using Audacity 2, or 1.2.6. Alright, now what I'm going to show you how to do is to make the pitch of a song higher and lower without changing the speed, and also how to make a soundtrack. Alright, the song I'm going to use for this is It's My Life by Bon Jovi. Also, it's a lot easier to um, use a soundtrack, or a song, from, or like if it's a wave or an mp3. Another way that you can do that is inside Audacity. Usually when I'm, when you're not recording, there's a, there's a bar right here where you can do stereo mix. And you, if you hit record, it'll play what's going on the screen or like what's in the background music. All right, so now that we know how to do that, I'm just gonna either well, there's two ways to do the same thing. You can either go to project, import audio, and then do the same thing again. It's my life, and it'll bring it up again. Or you can highlight it, hit Control C, then do generate or yeah, project, new audio track, and then paste. And it's the same thing. All right, now. I'm going to show you how to change the pitch. The reason I did two tracks was to show you the original along with the new one. All right, now to change the pitch, you go to Effect, Change Pitch. Now this starts on a B. And to go down to an F sharp or G flat, it's negative three semitones. It's always easiest to start with a C, um, like with piano and everything. So in a C to a C, it doesn't go a whole octave higher, it just starts at 0% change. You can use a slider if you want, but I just, I prefer using the letters. Alright, so a C to a C is a whole octave higher, so I'm going to go from a C to a G, which is half octave higher, and then hit OK, and then we're going to see what this sounds like. Also, if you hit play, it's going to play both tracks unless you hit mute or solo. Alright, let's see what it sounds like. Alright, that sounds that sounds pretty good. But there's other stuff that we can do, like we can import it again and then make it a lot lower. Or we can make it super high and make it sound like chipmunks or something. Alright, now for I'm gonna delete this track and I'm gonna show you how to make a soundtrack. So if you do project import audio, I'm gonna use Good Riddance Good Riddance by Green Day or uh, Time of Your Life import it. Now, one way to do it, which I don't really like, is you can cut this and then click over where it stops, where the first song stops, and then generate silence. Or, the way I personally like it, is you can just go to this soundtrack to where it stops, then hit paste. It'll paste it right in as this song ends, it'll play and that is a lot easier it'll save it as one track also for saving sometimes it won't always let you just do file say project as so to save it you can export it as a wave or an mp3 mp3s are a lot smaller but waves are a lot easier to work with alright thanks for watching my video